G'day guys, how you going? So I thought I'd just show you out here uh, around Kempsey just how bad the damage can be with uh, a bit of rain and water and thunderstorms and that stuff over a few days. So I'm here and this, where I am at the moment, is typically, this. well this is all farmland. All you can see over there, you'd, you'd almost swear that it's a, a reservoir or a dam actually and you know, this is where all the hay sort of ended up. Whether that, I don't think it was stocked up there. I think it's just come downstream, and that's sort of where it's locked up. Or unfortunately, you look over there, and old mate's um, actually lost his tractor. So you know, it's, it just shows how quick and and how sad it can be, and what can be lost, I suppose. Um, I, I really hope that everyone has been okay and got away from the floods. But this typically here is just a small creek that runs underneath the bridge, and you can see how bloody deep it is. Just by that tractor and you know that's probably the higher ground the the actual uh creek itself sort of over there so it's generally not a great deal of water here at all but I mean, that's that's meters deep down there now so it just goes to show in the, in the space of you know a, a few hours hours or even a day what mother nature can do to our great land i suppose so, although i just pull up on the road and i, I drove up the other day and i've come back down and you know there, there was points there that even in the the big four wheel drive that i was in so thanks mark candor from mk trucking for lending me his because my old au falcon i reckon uh would have struggled through a bit of the aqua plane and that's on well elevated highway so uh pretty dangerous when you're out there so uh just you know just check yourself in if you don't really have to travel guys then uh try not to for the next day or so because this is how quickly things can change and when the water's pelting into that windscreen, I mean, even as a, a well-seasoned interstate truck driver, I was driving that ute going, I can't see two foot in front of me here. This is uh, pretty bloody dangerous. So there you go, guys. Just thought I'd uh, share this with you, but yeah, dev devastate, devastating stuff, I suppose. But hopefully in the next couple of days, she clears up and some of this water can bloody get out to sea. So there you go, guys. Stay safe out there, everyone. It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty bad flooding up here on the, the mid-east the mid -east coast, I suppose, of, uh, yeah. This is Kempsey, I suppose, and I'm going back to my depot down in Warhope, which every road in is shut except for the old Bago Road, which, uh, yeah, ironically, is the oldest, worst road there is. Oh, look at that. We're getting a bit of rain on it. But the only way in, so, anyway, guys, shall catch us later have a good one equipment finance whether it's a truck a trailer an excavator a bobcat a hobby farm tractor or even some sort of a wood chipper give Brady Talbot a ring from Finlay's and he'll be able to sort you right out he comes highly recommended by myself and MK Trucking <laughs>